Hey, look what's behind us, and look who I'm with. David Chow Automotive Press, once hey again, coming to you guys from the LA Auto Show. This was at SEMA. Neither of us were at SEMA. This is the Toyota X-Runner pickup truck concept. Let's get into it. David, oh my gosh, like, rear wheel drive pickup trucks, that was a big thing in the 90s, yeah, right? Eight, was, even eight, 80s, 80s, I think. 80s, yeah, that was yeah. before my time, but you know. <laughs> and what we have here is something that is going to be nostalgic for so many people um, with this X-Runner. So, you flip the camera you here. know, there's so many details here because it is a pretty much fully custom top to bottom. Um, we have 421 horsepower from the twin turbo three and a half liter V6, um, 479 pound feet of torque. And that is actually a tune that we're going to see in the TRD performance package for That's the Tundra right. next year, yes. right? Yeah. So what a crazy idea to put um, the Tundra engine into uh, Tacoma. But not just the normal Tundra engine, it's the upgraded TRD Performance engine, which will be available as an option on, the, on Tundra next yeah. year. Uh, what a crazy idea, but you know, right. you begin to wonder, like, is Toyota foreshadowing something? I think so. You know, are they going to do so. this low slung, you know, cool truck thing? Let's take a quick walk around here, yeah. Kirk, and I mean, see. This, I, I just was with the Tacoma two days ago, and it said Tacoma here on the edge of the, the, the headlight. This is absolutely something that they could bring to production, yeah, putting small details like yeah. X-Runner in here. Now, so it is, I think, almost four inches wider than the normal Tacoma. And what else is wider on the Tacoma? The Trail Hunter and the TRD Pro, right? Yes. Well, we have a light bar probably down low to, to signify that wide to make it legal, right? And I mean, look how States. close it is to the ground, right? Yeah. It's it almost just a few inches above the ground. Probably eight inch, no, seven not inch even, ground clearance. Yeah, six, maybe? six, seven inch. It's not, it's clearly not designed for off roading, but look at this wing. This is like on a Supra, like it's actually yeah. a separate wing. It's super, super cool. So you, you mentioned off roading. Well, this is rear wheel drive only. Rear wheel drive only putting over 400 horsepower to those rear wheels so cool and the design of the side also quite different you can see the uh, side pipes that's integrated into the body yeah this is metal. exhaust coming in out this is an actual exhaust yeah that's actual alu i think it's aluminum yeah I'll, i'm gonna put the gopro underneath i yeah. don't know if it connects to anything yeah, but let me let me do the same thing here all the suspension is completely custom here I'll put that in the description if you guys want to look more into the details of this truck. But, you know, David, if if the Trail Hunter's anything to go by, they're really willing to work with OEM, or not OEMs, but aftermarket, um, aftermarket per, people yeah. to, to create a different. factory pickup truck that looks like it's been modified. Modi which, like right. heavily modified. Hey, this, look this, at the uh, color uh, matched um, tonal cover tonal here. Tonal cover, look at that. All the way through the back end, also tinted. This looks cool. Yeah, tented rear tail lights. You, you got can, the rear uh, spoiler as well. All the way, also very low to the ground. Another aerodynamic thing over here on the side. I mean, <laughs> you know, like you, you would have never believed if I told someone Toyota would do this, even as a concept. Sure. And, and I, yeah. if, if history is correct, Toyota tends to test the market, see how popular that concept is, and it, if it is, they tend to bring some of that element. So, you know, we might not see Gosh. like super low slung truck like this in the near future, but they might take some of the design elements and br bring it into the refreshed version of Tacoma. And, and hopefully maybe, who knows, some kind of a special, like a Ford Tremor type level performance by putting the 3.4. I mean, that would have been a killer Tacoma. Could you imagine that? That would be a killer Tacoma. What? It, they can do will, it. It's they, actually in there from my exactly. understanding. The engine's sitting in that car, it's, that truck, I should say, and I believe it is functional. It totally works. capable. Totally yeah. capable of doing that. So let's take a look here. Uh, I don't want to do a gap check on a <laughs> prototype. Concept, yeah. And it's very noisy here, by the way, but it looks really well built. I mean, this is custom built, but the body is, this part is all yeah. stock. This is a functional hood scoop, right, Kirk? That's it is a functional. functional. Yep, air feeds can, in there. You can see it. It feeds right into the engine compartment. You know, they won't allow us to get on the interior, but notice that this is the extra cab. You know, back in the day, it would be single cab or extra cab for these yeah. high performance trucks. You never see it on a four door. That's true. That's true. Yeah, you're right. And inside looks. It's like a TRD. I guess Pro. the seats are a little bit. Actually, seats are like the same as Tacoma, but uh, this it, is uh, yeah. this is the difference here, right? You get. Yeah, it's too bad they they get canceled the um, 
the what they call the access cam. I think that's canceled, yeah, the, right? The, yeah, the doors, there are yeah, no rear doors anymore on the, the extra cab. Um, holy cow, but the blue with the red looks really it's nice really here. Really fantastic looking here. And this is a, an old school color, I feel like a, a performance racing color from the 90s and maybe even the 80s. Yeah. It just, just bright blue. I don't think we have this color anywhere within Toyota lineup, no, I don't nothing. think. So special paint, special wheels. How big is the wheel? 21 inch. I think the biggest we biggest, yeah, biggest we get it is uh, 19, I think. David, on, these uh, are Tacoma, carbon right? fiber wheels. Oh yeah, yeah, these are custom built wheels. I, I was just reading about that too. Oh my too. goodness. This part might not be so custom, but that's no. definitely custom. And these are Michelin, what tire is that? Pilot Sport. Pilot so, Sport 4S, yeah. SUV, so yeah, interesting. So this, okay. this is a high performance tire. So this is actually a summer tire. Yeah, it's a summer tire, it's not even be. the old How season. How wide are these? 285s? 285, 45. It might actually need to be wider than that. <laughs> because there's no weight over the rear, as you know, in yeah, a, in a pickup true. truck. It's just a cool concept. Yeah. If you, I guess you can just take a normal Tacoma, tint, tint the back tail lamp, lower it, put 21 inch wheels, put a skirt, you know, some kind of aftermarket skirt, Jeez, and it so could nice. look pretty good, right? I mean, no Beautiful production vehicle design. will ever look like this, but like you said, I think it's them signaling of where they want to go and with the, the brand power of the Tacoma. Exactly. So. Yeah, it's cool things. So lots of cars to see here at the LA Auto Show. Um, but for Kirk and I, we both think that this truck is very special. Yeah. Uh, I guess we gotta wrap it up here, Kirk. Yeah, we gotta wrap it up. So. Uh, we got. We might collab on maybe the GX or something else. If you guys wanna stay tuned to our channels, we got so much more coming for you from the LA Auto Show. So goodbye to Kirk's friends, and you say goodbye, goodbye to, to David's my friends. friends. All right. All right we'll bye, see, guys. We'll see you guys. Peace.